it's time to review Someplace Delicious. Hi, this is Deborah, also known as Doobitch42. Welcome back to my channel. While you're thinking about it, go ahead and click that like button, okay? Today's Tuesday review is about one of my favorite quick kind of places to go in Greenville. And that is the, ta-da, Menkoi Noodle House. Now, they've got two locations in Greenville. They've also got locations, I think, in Columbia, maybe even in Charlotte. I'm not sure. But one of the locations in Greenville is on Woodruff Road, just like kind of everything else. And that's mostly a ramen noodle place. Now, don't think block of ramen that you buy at the grocery store. You're in for a whole different experience when you're talking about ramen. The other place is downtown, and it is an udon house. Now, udon noodles are sort of bigger noodles, sort of with a chewier texture, slightly different ingredients in the soup. It's delicious. They've also got soba noodles there too, in addition to the ramen and the udon. This is a place where you can get an inexpensive meal fast, and it is oh so delicious. I think I've tried just about every variety of ramen that they have um, at the locations, and Yum. The pork broth is my favorite, but they've also got a miso broth. They've got a, um, a salt-based broth, which is just a soy broth, which they use for their vegetarian options. They have several different kinds. They've got really spicy to not spicy at all. And something that I really, really found out that I love is udon noodles. Oh my gosh, those chewy noodles. Wonderful deliciousness. Mm. I'm not even hungry and my mouth is watering thinking about going out for ramen and I am not a soup person. I'm not a person who will go, yes, I believe I'll have the soup. No, that's not me. But ramen when done right is something magical. Um, you get this wonderful, super flavorful broth. You get, usually get a nice chunk of pork in there, which is delicious. Um, you get the noodles as well. Slurping is not only allowed, it's encouraged. That's right, you are supposed to slurp your noodles and you're supposed to enjoy the broth and then you pick up that bowl to get the rest of the broth. Oh, I will link to some of my favorite YouTube uh, folks that do stuff about ramen soup and about noodles in general. Just, you know, up here somewhere you'll see. And also I'll put the links in the description too, in case you've missed that. But if you get a chance to try real good ramen, do it. These folks even have a loyalty stamp card, basically. On this one, you buy 15 ramen, you get one free. And these big bowls of ramen, it's usually less than nine bucks. Eight for some of them. Yeah, and it's, don't think little bowl of soup. It's a meal. And it is so good. So don't poo-poo it. Don't turn your nose up at it until you have given it a try. And if you know me, search me down and I will come and eat ramen with you because I love it. And this place is a really good place to get it. It's fun, it's easy, it's quick, it's small. The location on Woodruff Road is very tiny. They don't have a lot of tables in there. They do a ton of takeaway business there. Um, the one that's downtown is a lot bigger and they have different options at lunch too, to where you just kind of go up and it's a lot faster process, even faster than getting your ramen normally so that you can rush through when you're you know, working downtown. You've only got a short lunch break. Come have a nice filling bowl of soup. Oh. Now, it's, you know, I want some ramen. I am really looking forward to my next trip to the Noodle House because that happens almost every time that I'm up in Greenville. Yeah, it's one of those places. Gotta go, gotta go. Maybe I'll see you there sometime soon. See ya.